Welcome to Rig's Life. I'm Tim and today we're going to protect the glass on our GoPros. First off we've got a GoPro Hero Session 5. This is a very small camera. I've used it a lot on my YouTube channel. It's great for adventure shots, motorcycles, biking, hiking, you know, just uh, it's a very small frame size, can go anywhere. I uh, use my GoPro app on my phone to uh, see what the camera's seeing and do uh, setup and modification. Of course, you can do it from the little screen on the top. But today, we're going to add a tempered glass glass protector to this. Secondly, we've got a brand new GoPro Hero 8 Black. Um, haven't had this very long at all. Uh, used it just a couple times, but really want to get the glass protected before we use it too much more, especially out on a motorcycle and rocks and things are flying. So what we're going to do is we're going to add uh, three protective covers for this GoPro Hero 8. One is a glass protector for the front lens, a plastic protector for the front screen, and another large glass protector for the rear screen. To do that, we've got for the Hero Session, the Aquox Tempered Glass Screen Protector. And it's a um, basically a three-step process. There's uh, three of them in here. Um, I haven't used one yet, so today will be the first time to apply this. I'm looking forward to that. And then we also have this GoPro 8 Glass. I believe it is by, um, here it says, it is a day yard. And this is a six-piece set. Again, so that would mean there's enough to do the camera twice. There's three uh, protective films and glass for the GoPro Hero 8. So we're going to apply this one also. I've never done this one as well. So we'll uh, get to that in just a second. We'll start with the, the session. I'm going to turn that camera up. Okay, now we'll open this packaging up here. So it looks like we've got uh, some dust absorber stickers and guide stickers. We've got three tempered glass lenses and we have three uh, wipes. One's a, a wet wipe to clean and one's a dry wipe to uh, prep the site before applying the glass. So we've got three of each. So we're going to take one here, one here, and one here and we'll put these up and save these for later applications. We'll start with our wet Make sure we're cleaning off the lens very, very good. Set that off to the side. We've got our dry we've opened up. I'm going to dry that off. Make sure all the oils and debris is off of there. Gonna make sure it's very, very dry. That looks good. Set that off to the side. And we've got our dust sticker. Put that on there just to make sure that any dust is completely removed. So now we have our um, lens. So the front, the sticky part, is protected. We're going to peel that off. And again, there is there is a um, angled side there, and that's where the microphone is. So you make sure you apply the angled side to the correct side. And we stick it on there, get it on straight, and then you can let it down. That looks good right there. It's floating on there, and now it is sealed. There we go. So now I'm going to take the dry, and I'm sorry, I'm going to take the wet, I'm going to wipe the front that's stuck on there, and that also applies it really tight to the outside. Okay, now I'm going to dry that off. And we have a tempered glass protector on our Hero Session 5. Move on to our um, GoPro Hero 8. So we have, these are the small screen protectors there. We have our, again, our one, two step process. And there's two kits here, so I'm going to pull out one for each. We have one front screen and one, uh, that's another back screen, uh, front screen. So there's two of each. Okay, there we go. We've got a cloth, and we have the stickers, the dust remover stickers. So, I've got everything I need here. Put these off to the side. The first one I'm going to do is the front lens. I'm going to make sure I get that's the most important one that has to be clean and clear. So, 
there's the wet right there open up this is the dry open it up keep my oils on one side so we dry it off nice and dry keep that right there now I've got my dust remover sticker just to make sure nothing's left stuck on there there we go put that right back there now we're going to add our front glass so we have that right here okay set this off to the side and this one is completely square so it doesn't really matter how I uh, apply it as long as I get the proper So I need to, this is the sticky side, so I'm going to peel that off. Again, keeping it very, do not touch it with my fingers. I'm just going to drop it right, perfectly centered on the lens. Making sure that it was centered on there. It looks very, very good. All right, so oh, I can see it sealing right there. There it went. So it's sealed. I just push that on right there. And we have a good, clean lens protector there. Now, I'm going to move on over to the front screen. It's going to dry, wipe, wet that, dry that. Get a little dust remover. Now we'll add on one of the small screens. If I can figure out how to get this out of here. There we are. Open up the package for the front screen protector. Take out those there we are now these are together and I have to remove one of them okay and it is sticky side at the bottom make sure I don't get my fingers on there and you can use the um, uh, the guide stickers and I probably should that keeps your fingers off of it but I think I might do that for the back. All right. Got that one on there. Now we're going to move over to the back. Again, let's give it a nice little cleaning with a cloth. A wet clean. I think I'm going to use the guide sticker on this one that's so big. I don't want to get my fingerprint on it. Okay. Do that. And we'll just do some dust removers. Make sure there's no dust off of the... Paper. Now the large screen. Okay, we have a large screen. Okay, this is the sticky side. So what I'm going to do is I'm going to take one of these guide stickers, and I, I should use those on the other ones. But and uh, if I ever do it again, I probably will. So this is the sticky side. So I'm going to put the guide sticker right there. That'll hold on to it for me. That way, I ain't got to touch touch the uh, sticky side at all. Okay. So then we got a guide sticker. Put it right on there. Tempered glass goes down. It seals right on there. And once it's sealed, I'm going to take my cloth and get that final stick to it. And that is clean, clean, clean. Hope everybody can see how clean that is. There you go. That is a very, very, very clean, protected glass on all sides. I'm very happy with that. Now we can get on the road, get on our motorcycle, and uh, protect our screen. I want to remind everybody on the GoPro Hero 8, you cannot change that front glass lens yourself. If you look at the uh, GoPro Hero Session, see these screws here? Uh, and I've already had to replace this in the past. I cracked that glass and I bought bought more and you take these screws out and there's an O-ring gasket in there but GoPro has decided that uh, to stay more uh, waterproof that they wouldn't allow you to change your own lens out so you have to send this in to get that lens replaced so I want to protect it at all costs that's why we're putting the glass on this one and really why I waited so long on this because I was just replacing the glass whenever it got cracked but very happy with that and I think we are going to move on well there we go we got the GoPro Hero 8 glass and screens protected. We have our GoPro Hero Session 5 protected as well with the front tempered glass protector. I am very happy with these and I will put the links to each of these in the description. 
And I hope everyone has a wonderful, blessed day, and go Ridge Lab.